I was trying to flash a custom recovery on Samsung Galaxy Note 5 having latest Android Nougat. Recovery was flashed, also boot in custom recovery, did a backup and then what? I am having a boot loop, means that Note 5 is not booting back and this is happening if we are trying to flash a custom recovery via Odin software only on Nougat. So today I will show how to flash a custom recovery on Note 5 that will not end it up with boot loop. Custom recovery will boot and also Note 5 will boot back to stock. So let's get started then. What's up everyone? Welcome to my channel Tech Infomania. Galaxy Note 5 must be rooted having Android Nougat and if in case your set is not rooted then check out my video Rooting Samsung Note 5 Nougat Latest. Install the Samsung USB driver for Windows in case if you do not have it. Download the custom recovery for Note 5 according to your model number. For example, I have T-Mobile variant model is N920T so I will go for N920T recovery I will download the image file not the tar file because I will flash the recovery in my note 5 with the help of flashify app that is only for Android devices now download the Flashify app from here and then copy both file that is the recovery image and Flashify to the Note 5 internal storage. Go to setting of the Note 5 then go to lock screen and security and check the unknown sources. Turn it on in case if it is off. Go back and now go to about device and click the build number for seven times go back now and go to developer options and turn on the oem unlock and usb debugging as well in case if it's off after turning on the, both the options now go back to menu and uh, Open your Samsung file manager that must be my file and install the Flashify app that you already copied in your Note 5 internal storage. After installing the Flashify app, open that Flashify app, click accept, click OK. Grant the permission of super user request. Click OK and now click the recovery image. Now choose a file. And uh, now click on file explorer. Now go to your SD card, you are going to see that SD card click and open it and you are going to see that uh, recovery file that I already copied my internal storage. Uh, I am going to select uh, this uh, image file to flash. Confirm it, it asking me, yes, click yep. And it will start flashing and your recovery flashing is completed click reboot now and your set will going to reboot in your custom recovery and we can see that custom recovery is flashed successfully swipe it to allow modifications and uh, now we need to check either our Note 5 will be boot back to stock from here or the boot loop will come again. And uh, finally Note 5 is uh, booting to stock from here means no boot loop this time. 
so finally note 5 boots up and uh, just for checking I am going to boot back in custom recovery manually by switching off the set now to check the booting of stock firmware for booting into custom recovery manually we need to press and keep holding volume up and home keys and will power on the set and when logo appear then release only the power key and release rest both the keys when you see the recovery screen make a backup of uh, your stock firmware and uh, reboot it uh, once again to make sure that the set is uh, booting back to stock and yes it is uh, booting to stock this uh, was the procedure of flashing a custom recovery on latest Nougat and white version on Galaxy Note 5 without having a boot loop. Enjoy using rooted Note 5 with having a custom recovery and you can flash a custom ROM on your Note 5 now. Thank you for watching my video. Please do subscribe my channel and click the bell icon and stay up to date. We'll see you guys in my next video. Till then, goodbye.